Hello you guys, what's up? Welcome back to Vlogmas Day 13. It's a Wednesday. It's a great Wednesday because I'm back on my routine for like two days. <laughs> um, I'm headed to work out with my trainer, Jane. I do strength training with her once a week. So I'm filling up my water. I had my nice morning routine uploaded or promoted, should I say, the podcast was getting the Vlogmas stuff situated and just had a nice morning. Brooke and I are going to record the podcast today at the studio, so that'll be fun because we won't be together next week. Um, so we wanna get next week's episode done because we'll both be, well, I'll be home for Christmas. Um, I don't know when she's going home, but when I go home, I go home for a minute because I am from Florida and my family lives there and my dog and I have family coming into town and I just like to spend a little bit more time. I can't like go back and forth to the city, unfortunately. I've been standing in front of my heat dish all morning. It feels so good. We must blow out this candle. It's literally called a big ass candle. <sighs> it smells amazing though. Lowdown for the day. It's gonna be a really fun day, I think. After I record the podcast, we're going shopping because I have a couple more little Christmas gifts I need to get for people that I'm gifting like this week. Tonight, I have a secret Santa gift exchange with um, some of my influencer pals, but they're also my real friends. Uh, and then tomorrow night, I have another secret Santa with a few of my other friends. So I have all those gifts actually ready, but I wanna go to a paper source and get like pretty wrapping paper. I might have wrapping paper, but I need a gift bag because some things you just can't wrap. And I'm also lazy at times, so. Um, but I'm hosting the Secret Santa tonight at my apartment. We're gonna like already have eaten dinner before, but I said I would have a cheese board and I think Katie's gonna bring some sweets, I think, which sounds amazing. So I wanna get some cheese board stuff. We're gonna prepare the cheese board. It'll be a fun night. I always love hosting people at my apartment during the holidays in specific, cause I feel like I curate a vibe in here, especially at night, what do you guys say? And then tomorrow night I have Secret Santas uh, with my friends Cass, Kelly, and Seb. I think we're like going to dinner for that one. Um, so yeah, I'm excited and I can't wait. I won't show you guys. Well, I guess I can tell you guys who I have for tonight because this vlog is going up after. I have Margo, Margo Ashri. Um, I've never had her because we've done this a few times and I don't have her, I've never had her. So I'm excited. I'm very proud of the stuff I got her. She, we like did little wish lists and she basically said something that'll make her cry. She was like, I'm in the mood to cry. And then also, um, ski stuff because she's going on like a big ski trip with her fam. So I'm really proud of the stuff I got. I'll wait to show you guys, but I think I think one of the things that's gonna make her cry, or if not cry, it'll touch her heart. <laughs> I kinda wanna put in earrings, but that's so, oh my gosh, I need a hair tie. Like This bag from Zara is amazing. It literally just looks like a cute little purse, but it fits my, my full water bottle that I was filling up is in here. And then obviously these um, headphones double as my earmuffs in the cold. I don't even know what the temperature is outside, but if I'm cold in my apartment, I just have a feeling it's cold out there. Oh, hair tie. I've been into scrunchies lately. Like usually I just wear them at home. Like I don't take scrunchies out, but I weirdly, I feel like my hair looks better. Like I think it's a cute little accessory one and two, I think my hair doesn't crease as much with like a bigger scrunchie. I don't know, that could just be me. And then my mom comes into town tomorrow because we have our New York Gals on the Go live show, which I think there's literally a few tickets left. At least when I looked on Ticketmaster, I saw like two. So snatch those up. And also some people unfortunately haven't been able to go now. So we've been reposting ticket, like people selling their tickets on the Gals in the Go podcast Instagram. Highly suggest because like yesterday this girl was selling second row tickets. So, and I know some people were selling meet and greet tickets. So definitely keep an eye out on Gals in the Go podcast Instagram because you could come to the show and have a night this Saturday night, December 16th at Town Hall in Times Square, uh, 8 p.m. I think doors open at seven. We're selling exclusive merch there. It's gonna be so fun. I'm like leaning when I could just pick up the camera. But yeah, I'm excited to have a little walk to the gym, get a workout in, and then we've got a whole day ahead. So welcome back to Vlogmas. Thank you to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. I feel like it's so important to remember that you don't have to have like this whole thing going on in your life. Sometimes it's those day-to-day -day things that start to build up and you don't even know you wanna talk about them until someone starts asking you questions. That's why I love therapy and I love BetterHelp because it's so easy to get a therapist, get matched with the therapist. It's so lovely. During the holiday season, like I, 
I need my therapist more than ever. I don't know why, because it's such a happy time, but I think there's just like a lots of emotions going on. We're also doing Gals in the Go live shows right now, and my social battery is just getting super um, low. <laughs> and so I find times like this really, really helpful. Like, especially when I go home for the holidays, I've literally done therapy when I am home and I'll just go in my car and do it so I still have private time. BetterHelp's mission is to make therapy more affordable and accessible, which I think is so important, especially like if you don't wanna go into an office and sit in that waiting room and everything. I literally am about to do it right here on my computer. Boom, done. It's easy to sign up and get matched with a therapist. And if, you, if you're not meshing with that therapist, you can totally switch one, which is so awesome. So you guys need to go to betterhelp.com slash Danielle Carolyn. If you click on that link, it'll support my channel, but also we'll get you 10% off your first month of BetterHelp. So if you're needing that little push, like I gotta do therapy, I wanna start, I just don't know where to start, go on BetterHelp. You just fill out a brief questionnaire and then you get matched with a licensed professional and you get 10% off your first month if you click the link down below. So it's super easy. So if you're struggling, consider online therapy with BetterHelp. Help. Go to betterhelp, H E L P dot com slash Danielle Carolyn. I'll also have it linked below and on the screen, and you get 10% off your first month. guys are currently sitting on the salad spinner I got Ryan for Christmas I got him other things too but he's been really wanting a salad spinner and he's gonna be like wow you I like remember things he says and then I write him down doing my makeup for the podcast workout was good got my OPP smoothie Mwah. I just got this lip or what are they calling it lip oil lip oil balm from Saltaire I just used the body wash in the shower as well this one so I have this one which is called toasted this one is dragon fruit, but this one's clear, which I always like gravitate towards, and it tastes and smells like cake, and I really like it. Like, I can smell it. No, I guess I don't taste it, but I can smell it. I don't really understand when people are like, this one tastes good. I'm like, are we like eating this lip balm? Anywho, I also picked up this at Target on my way back from my workout. This is the e.l.f. Halo Glow Liquid Filter. When we were in Austin, it's made by Beck, did my makeup, and I noticed she was using this on my face, and I have this one from Charlotte Tilbury, and she thinks this one is better, and it's obviously way cheaper, so I bought it because I was inspired, and I'm going to give it a try now. I usually do like a full face of makeup for podcasting, but I noticed like she... And she did, she used this in, in tandem with foundation for the live show because like we were taking so many pictures. But I've noticed on her page, she's a makeup artist obviously, she will sometimes just use this. And I sometimes do that with the Flawless Filter Foundation, but I feel like it kind of slides around and she said this like stays in place. So I'm very interested. Um, it's that day, you know like the day comes when you have to wet your beauty blender? It's today. Okay, I just did foundation only. So far, I have the Estee Lauder Double Wear Foundation on. This is like a full coverage foundation, which I need. My skin is just so uneven recently. I don't know what's happening. Uh, I think it's just like all the makeup I keep putting on it because of live shows and stuff. Um, but I'm going to try and put this over top because I feel like it gives you a glow. I don't know. I just got, what color did I get? I think I got three. Yeah, three light medium. I don't know. It's like a little pinky. I don't even know if you guys can see a thing, but like I feel like you usually put it on the high points of your face or places you want a glow. I mean, it's glowing. It's definitely more full coverage. Okay, wow. Makeup is done. I've been loving wearing brown eyeliner recently. I feel like it just makes my eyes pop. So makeup doesn't look that bad. 
we're chilling. I just need to figure out my hair and then I need to bring, I need to pack my bag. And I'll do my lips in a second. And then we need to get on the road. We have a show to get to, AKA Gals in the Go podcast. I just need everyone to know that I went from feeling so blah to now I feel kind of cute. Sometimes you just gotta slick your hair back and have a puff down or all the way back, add a bow and some hoops and I feel myself again. Here is my outfit to record. This sweater is from Cynthia Rowley. I love this turtleneck. I don't know, I just like the way it's shaped. I like how it's structured. I added this red bow in. This is the side I sit on for the podcast, so I always like test out. I'm like, okay, how's it gonna look from this side? Earrings are from Oma the Label. Jeans are Hudson. And I'm just wearing my New Balances because I'm subwaying there and I just want, I kind of in a rush where I need to go. And when I have sneakers on, I can just walk a little bit faster. And we're gonna head out. I'm also bringing a change of clothes because we just have to film an intro for the week after we have like the episode film. We just have to like film the intro. So we like to pretend <laughs> that it's a different day, even though here I am telling you guys. Um, my phone's over there, so we're, I'm gonna like change into a different sweater and like do a hat instead. Let's go! Episode one. Now we're just Ooh. doing the intro. I'm exposing us. <laughs> oh, no, I said the same. Okay, yeah. okay. Yeah. Um, so this is my second outfit. It's very simple, but I just I love this hat and I've been wanting to wear it. So we're gonna wear it on pod. Brooks wearing a little nudes tank. tank. I feel Pop. like it's like um, an ice skating costume or something, yeah. you know, like or gymnastics. Like, you know, yes, like, the leotard, one hundred percent. So we're changing Sticks in the bathroom. The Sticks the landing. And guys, we're giving out hot cocoa in the lobby. And they have a flute, or flutist, a uh, harpist, or harp, harpist? Lots Someone playing the harp. music. Lots Live of cool music. music. It's very festive up there, or down there, wherever. So we're gonna do this, and then we'll be done for 2023 for the podcast we did. Crazy. Just wrapped. Today's one of those days where you're just gonna see me in a thousand outfits and we're just gonna have to <laughs> roll with it. I have my red light on, so that's why I'm a little red. I wanna show you guys what I got for Margot because I'm about to wrap it all. The star of the show, like I said, she wanted something that's gonna make her cry or maybe be sentimental. Ah! So I got her this sweatshirt and it's from the Etsy shop. I believe it's called Pet Made. And it's a picture of her dog, Magnolia. It's like Era's tour merch. I took a ton of photos from her Instagram of Magnolia, and it says Magnolia's version. Like, it's a gray sweatshirt. There's other colors, but I was like, gray is neutral because there's like so much color going on. I feel like she will actually wear this because she just loves her dog so much, and it's so comfy and so cozy. I can't wait to see her react. I, I don't know if she'll cry. I mean, maybe she will. That'd be exciting if she cried because she wants to cry. But I, either way, I think it's like a sentimental gift, and I cannot wait to see her face. And then I also, she's going skiing, so I got her two like ski headbands. I got her this one. They're both from the brand Goldberg. I have it in this thing. I guess I could, should I take it out? I'm gonna take it out. Um, I actually texted with her sister Jackie and I was like, do you know what her ski suit looks like? Because I don't know, you know, I don't wanna get her a headband that looks bad. So I sent a couple options and she was like, these are the ones that would go best with her ski suit. Cause she like found out what Margo was wearing, thank God. So this is like a purpley magenta pink one from the brand Goldberg. And they always look so cute. She's gonna look so fab. It honestly goes with the sweatshirt. And then I also got her this one from Goldberg. I'm gonna like lightly unwrap it because I wanna put the pink one in here too. So I bought them from two different websites. Oh gosh, I hope I'm not regretting this. This one, like, I am obsessed. Like, I love the black and white rib. It's such good quality. It's so warm. It'll keep her ears nice and warm. I, I don't ski. I've never skied, but I've heard good things about Goldberg. So, and I feel like it's a recognizable brand, and she's going to be so excited to have not one, but two ski headbands. And then lastly, I got her. So, Margo loves the Dirty Martini, and I have seen these before. I just thought it would be such a little extra thing, part of the gift. It's a martini glass with a little fake olive in it. 
I don't even know if she makes martinis at home really, but either way, this would look so cute on her shelf. It's so her, I mean, I don't think she already has it, but I wouldn't be surprised if she already had it. Um, but see, I just had to unwrap it to show you guys and now I'm gonna regret that. So that is what I got Dear Margo and I am so excited for her to open it. I need to assess what gift wrapping I already have and then anything I don't have, I'm gonna go to Paper Source because I love that place so much and get things because I also need to wrap stuff for Ryan. Ryan's actually gonna come join me for some, we're about to go run some errands. Yeah. I know I have stuff in here. Guys, we are so golden. I don't even think I need to go to Paper Source. I really stocked up last year. I knew I had... Wow, this wrapping paper I didn't even touch. I have the red King King paper. And then I have so many. These are definitely from Paper Source. I have this one, this one. I have a ton of these, actually. And then I have a big Christmas tree one. Smaller bags, I think. And I have so much tissue paper. So, I do believe that saves me a trip to paper source even though i was looking forward to it it's not necessary and i still i need to go to whole foods and get cheese board stuff because i my contribution if you will is going to be a cheese board i don't think we're like drinking tonight um but i have so many like seltzers and spritz and stuff in the fridge and then i wanted to ryan's gonna join me to run errands because we're realizing we're running out of days to like hang out before we both go home and i'm like okay well i have to run these errands so you're gonna come Look how cute my tree looks back there. I'm wearing my favorite outdoor voices fleece. It's so good. I'll have it linked below. It's just red. And they have other colors too, but I love the red one. Um, Ryan said he wants to get something for his sister. He wanted my help getting the gift for her. And then I was going to go to Madewell to get him something. But if he's with me, maybe I could do that now and then he can meet me after. I don't know. Okay, we're in Madewell. She's running loves this store. We're gonna grab him something very good. Okay, we're back now. I'm playing some Christmas music. Ryan's here for moral support. I just went and got a ton of things to make a cheese board. I warned the girls. I was like, this is not gonna be my prettiest cheese board because they are like pro cheese board makers and I am not but I know like all the good things to put on it. So we got manchego, cheddar, brie, some mozzarella. I like love these mozzarella balls. Pepperoni. Oh, I meant to get sausage or salami. Oh well. Crackers, they love these. I love water crackers with brie in specific. And then I got prosciutto, fresh cut, olives, cause they're olive girlies and then grapes. So hopefully I'll do okay. It's Christmas when the snow starts to fall. Then you know it's Christmas for the children above all. Then you know it's Christmas. Cause Santa's on his way. We stand under the mistletoe. And then he Christmas Day. All right, I don't think this turned out half bad. It's not my finest work. I already warned the girls to set expectations low. It doesn't look that cute, but the contents, the quality are so delicious. I Not a lot of people do mozzarella balls on their cheese board, but Delaney and I always did in college, so I always add that. And this one was like a mix of tomatoes and mozzarella, which I thought was tasty. We've got the brie, I need to get a knife for that. Grapes add some color. This is definitely like a bland board. Ryan cut the manchego for me, which I really appreciate. And, uh, you know, she's not bad. I was literally using this light to show you guys. Okay, I need to wrap Margo's gift. I'm going to light my big ass candle. So when my friends walk in, it just smells absolutely incredible. I should probably clear under my Christmas tree because we'll probably put the gifts there when they walk in. We usually don't like label the gifts, but it's like, okay. Brooke, you're first, and she'll like stand up and go get the gift and give it to whoever she had. I'm so excited to see who has me. My prediction right now is that Brooke has me. I feel like Brooke has me because last year she was like, oh, who do you have? And I'm like, dude, there's only a few of us. It's gonna just, you know, ruin the whole thing. So she hasn't said a thing to me this year, so I kind of feel like she has me. But I could be wrong. I could be wrong. Okay, I'm just gonna wrap 
because you know bags are easier however this when I have something structured if I can I want to wrap it with wrapping paper because it's, it's always fun for someone to open something with wrapping paper so the other things are like soft so I'm gonna put those in a bag but this martini glass is just asking to be wrapped ta-da this is so cute I love this little bag and then the wrapping paper she's gonna love it okay let's make some room under the tree here I just have my advent calendars that I've been forgetting to show you guys each morning, so we'll have to do a review, a recap later. Okay, I just did my hair back the way it was before because I feel like it's very <laughs> festive. I keep saying that word. Uh, and I'm just gonna keep this on. I tried it on a different sweater, but like I just love this outdoor voice, this fleece so much that I feel cute. Um, so yeah, I just did like a half a puff down with the bow. Oh, the final touch. I need to put on a Yule log. On my TV, I feel like they'll be like, they'll walk in and say, Danielle, why isn't there a fireplace on your TV? And they would be right. Okay, we're gonna start with this one. I just, it spoke to me. <laughs> and I think everything else, we've got the vibes going. Actually, I'm thinking, I do this sometimes when I have people over. I think I'm gonna take that and the books off of the coffee table and I'll bring the food over here because we're all gonna be sitting and eating. I think that's a good idea. Oh yeah, this is such a vibe. I forget what it's like to have a whole coffee table that you can actually put stuff on, because mine is very decorated, <laughs> and I live alone, so it's not really a big deal, but whenever I have people over, I'm like, I need to clear this off. But obviously the candle stays. And now we wait for them to arrive. I want to eat so bad, but like, <laughs> there's nothing worse than showing up and like the chief board's all picked over. So, I... I'm just sitting here. I have like, I'm having like a bite of a grape or something, but I just want to wait. I'm gonna track them. We said start at 7:30. It's 7:20. Oh, Brooks almost here. She said she was gonna be late too. Let's see. Katie's home, but we live really close. Margot is en route. I haven't seen them all in so long. Well, I've seen Brooke like every single day, but I haven't seeing Katie and Margo in a minute, and these are my favorite types of nights where we just catch up and eat food and give each other gifts that are really meaningful, so I'm excited, I'm ready. It's gonna get me in the holiday spirit. I mean, I already am, let's be real, but you know what I mean. The first person is here. Oh my gosh, it's I you! Know. I'm ready. I thought you were gonna be the last. I thought that I would be too, but there was no traffic. Oh, welcome. Hi. Sorry, for, you know my hallway is always crowded. The second person has arrived. Oh my god, it's Margo! How'd yeah, you know before you even like open I have a people. Oh, hi. <laughs> ho, ho, ho. <laughs> Brooke bought, brought all kinds of yummy goodies. And the last guest has arrived. I'm the last one. Hi. I know, usually you're the first. How crazy. Hi. The girls are here. I can't wait. I was like waiting to like touch the food until you guys got here. So yeah, I, I'm very excited. You did a great job, by the way. Yeah. I, I said you didn't. Because it's not like pretty. Like it's not a Katie Bellotti board, but like, you know. Board. And like I, I tried to keep the meats like away from the cheeses. Like I, I, I did my That's best. Really nice um, I guess because, so. because I'm kosher. Because you're kosher. kosher. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> that is why. No, you did a great job. I, I tried. And Katie got no nuts for Brooke. I like we're, so <laughs> we're a nice so friend group. <laughs> Accommodated for. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> everyone's there. The gift exchange is about to begin. I'm gonna like give to the person. You're Santa. I'm no, I'm, I'm not, not doing who I bought. Oh, oh, yeah. I'm not gonna be. Like, ho, ho, ho. All right. <laughs> I had Margaret. <laughs> Brooke was like, I'm already filming. <laughs> I haven't had you before, Margo. I was oh, very excited. Oh, a martini glass, you know it. But, but it has like an olive in it. Like, a, I don't know if you already have this. I, don't think, I, I think this is what I got from Bergdorf for one of those. It's, um. <gasps> oh, so. Yeah, you don't even have to use it, but you can put it on your shelf. No, but I have a whole wet bar. Like, this Perfect. is a place for it. I just oh, felt I like, love. it's just a little something. I just had oh, wait, to add adorable. a little bar. <laughs> so you said you wanted ski gear. I did say that. And I'd help from your sister on like what ski suit. Did Jackie ask you what ski suit you had or something? That's why she's being so yeah. funny. <laughs> this is your sentimental gift. Oh, I, I wrote in my wish list like I want to cry. <laughs> oh. I don't know if you'll cry. I don't know if I'll cry, but. But it's um. <laughs> Is it Eris Tour? Magnolia's, Magnolia's version? Magnolia's oh my Eris. god! I saw the colors. Oh. I was like, this is something she'll actually wear. And I literally screenshotted photos from your Instagram. You have a lot of Magnolia photos on Instagram. 
That's a really thoughtful. So thing. it's all those are actually so well, because I was looking up Taylor Swift merch. You don't have to cry. You don't have to cry. But I appreciate the tears. <laughs> My gift is for Miss Katie. Oh, oh! And I do have to say, you filled out your wish list twice. <laughs> like, like, remember how you said you're like, oh, I filled it in. Bruh. Ah! I'm gonna Oh, ho, ho. It is decorated differently. Katie, you wrapped this so beautifully. Look, <laughs> wow. Oh my god, there's, there's lemons? So it's, it's oranges. I um dried them in the oven and shut them up. Them. Oh, I saw you cutting yeah, them. I was working. I was You're crazy. crazy. Wow, you have to wear that the night before the live show. Every night the, before the live show. Yes, it was the night. The the night. Yeah, I, love, I love the material. It's like That's so warm, cute. But still, I love a long yeah. pant and wow. Um, Wait, I'll does this mean after. that? Yes. So I knew it, but you know why I knew it? Because you didn't today. talk about it at all. Because last year Brooke was like, who do you have? I'm like, we can't do that because, but you didn't ask yeah. me this year. No, I didn't ask Oh, oh I can't wait. There's not very many of us. So no, I know. Elimination. I, that's what I figured here too. And I knew that like we had each other last year, so it was a process of elimination. I had Danielle. Oh my God. Nice. You shouldn't have. I should have. Oh, thank you. Okay. Once again, a multi-part gift. Is it okay. recording? You know, it's been really Bergdorf's great. Bergdorf's I see. Oh, no. It's been great traveling with Danielle recently because I've been seeing what she needs here on the road. Oh no, I'm oh, no. no, it's good. Wait, oh my god. I don't know, maybe it's not as, uh, we'll see, we'll see. Oh my god, oh, I'm excited. Multi-part gift too. Yeah, it's a multi-part. Is this one okay? Today? Yes, this is a good one to start with actually because this is like tour coded. <laughs> <laughs> We're on tour. You're standing, you're standing, that. You're standing up. Standing. Like She's like the like, teacher. Hopefully you like it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you have to see the vision here. Is it a garment bag? Oh my god! I almost bought myself Wait. one because I always use yours. Oh, oh my own garment in bag. Pink. Oh, bro, in that pink. is so thoughtful. Oh, of course. Oh of my course. gosh, because we always bring our stuff. We and do, I've just and been it's like, a mess, and we bring like old store garments. Yeah, bags. from like Revolve Wait, dresses. Brooke, this is oh, beautiful. What embroidered this mess. Then. Wait, um, I'm obsessed. Yeah, there was limited options of the patterns, but I feel it's like neutral. it's like, and I it's love basic. Red. Yeah. Thank you so wait, much. That's so thoughtful. Yeah. Oh wait, that was I love it. That was one of the thoughtful. Oh my gosh. Wait, yeah. did you wrap these? Yes, Ben helped a little. <laughs> oh, did ben do this one. This one's good. That um, one's good. Maybe he helped cut it. A little. <gasps> oh yes, I thought that you would like. Is this a Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Daddy. Oh, you did say you wanted something from Ralph Lauren. I did. Yes, yes. The teddy bear sweater was not in budget. Oh, no. No, I wasn't sure. No. <laughs> I wasn't sure. They're out of budget. budget. Yeah. Oh my god. He's a little cutie. Would you, would you oh. hang oh. Oh. I get a job. Would you do the honors? I get a job, a little bear. Yes. He's so cute. No. Oh exactly. my gosh. I asked for a coffee. I said I wanted a coffee table. Coffee table, table book. Book. Yes. Wait, this is beautiful. I've never seen this one. Ooh. I love Italy. I, I love Italy. Italy. Yes. I love Italy. She has like, you know, the coastal. Oh, yes. I love it. She's my QVC host. Oh, Twitter, today like, explaining why her gifts are great. Yeah, yeah every single one needs sure Wait, I love this. They're good. <laughs> it, it does go with like my painting. Your energy in here. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, of course. <laughs> oh, another one. This is so fun. Yes. Well, you gave a detailed wish list. But no. <laughs> <laughs> well, I always, I was just like, no, I was great. Please. I went on Pinterest. Oh, I was like, really? what have I saved recently? Are you so <gasps> so she literally put this on her wish card. The exact item. The exact item. I forgot. Oh, so you were probably quaking when we went to the Loewe store? I knew you, you told me a while ago, you're like, I really want to smell the tomato candle, tomato candle, and then you put on the wish list, and then we went to the Loewe store. Tomato store, candle. Did you almost yeah. buy it for yourself? They didn't have it. Oh, no, but no. I literally, you're so right, I've been going on and on with this fucking tomato candle, yeah, and yeah. I haven't smelled it yet. She's like, I want to try it. I want to, so I got, I got one for my <laughs> secret Santa that I have tomorrow, but I could, it's so hard to choose it's a sticker. scent online. Oh, yes. Yeah, I, I just guess anything. Yes. Oh, I like how oh, it works. smells good. It smells like a garden it's or a something. It's a tiny candle. Oh, very fresh. It's, it's a good kitchen candle. I like, yeah. Oh, yeah, it smells like, like herbs. It's a good, good kitchen candle. It's a good cooking candle. I like it. Oh, I get a little hint of tomato in like, there, Like, oh, though. look, fresh tomato. Oh, I'm so, I'm just going to keep it just like this. Oh, I mean, I'm going to burn I love it, the box. Yeah, so I'm going to keep the box. Yeah, yeah, the box. Like, that's, that's, that's hot. Hot. Uh, that's hot. That's hot, baby. That's giving looks. This is giving bougie. I think there's one more. I got a garment bag. We're getting old, where I'm like excited about yeah, You're like, wow, that coffee table book, man. <laughs> I know, I can't wait to go through that. That's it. Yeah, thank you for filming. Reverse. Yeah, All right, and for her last and trick. Last trick. 
This is also tour inspired. Um, I obviously couldn't find the item that you use with mine all the time, so I went for a different multiple. Oh my god, I cannot wait. I love like, the walkthrough of each good. gift, bro. Holy shit! Oh, I hope it's good. So, Brooke. Oh my god. Oh my god. Thanks. I got it on sale Black Friday. I was, say, I was literally about to say, you say budget? I mean, like, this I is about for us. I did say budget Black Friday sales were very good. So this is yeah. <laughs> I, by the way, yeah, I agree. That was, mine that was well. same. So Rob Brooke Warren. and I, I used um, every show. I use her body glow, and I'm like, oh, I gotta get it. But the Soul Day Janeiro one sold out. So she got me. So she this got is, me. I went ten levels up. <laughs> no problem. Thank you. What brand is it? Oh, Macy's. Oh, yes, oh, yes, oh, 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 I thought it was Mason Margiello. It is. Oh, it's Mason Margiello. No, Mason Margiello. Oh, I saw Mason and I was. It is Mason Margiello. But it's body glow. Oh my god, I can't wait. I need a full review. Saturday. Yes, I don't know. I saw. I tried. Thank you, Brooke. 11.34 and that's a wrap. The last gals just left. There was really only four of us, but um, I'm so grateful. The gifts were so sweet. Oh, I have to check on my little ornament. It's so cute. My little Ralph Lauren 2023. So cute. That's it for today's vlog. Hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you so much to BetterHelp for sponsoring this video. I'll have that link down below for you guys to get some money off your first month. And I'll see you guys tomorrow.